Sam Jed from GDK Veneering. Thank you very much for watching the video that we're going to be doing is a Jaguar Mark 10. Now the Jaguar Mark 10 has four door cappings, i.e. like this one. I've already veneered the centerpiece and now what we're preparing to do is getting it ready for the cross banding that will fit nicely along there and that looks like that and then that should be glued on tomorrow down there. That's the veneering done on the Jaguar door cappings. So first thing what I'm going to do, it is quite aggressive, but you need to be or else you're going to be here all year. So the first thing we're going to do is I'm going to put it into the vise. And I'm going to really tighten it up so it's nice and tight. You're going to need a mask because there's going to be plenty of dust. Now I could plane this, but with a plane, you're going to get like a bit of a jagged edge and we can't have that, it has to be nice and smooth. So, I won't, I'll be able to talk, not very good, but I'll just try and talk you through it. So, I've got a nice hard stick with some Velcro on and some sandpaper. Now what I'm going to attempt to do, if you have a look here, the veneer has actually gone over the woodwork, so we've got to sand that back, so it allows us to put that cross banded onto it. So here it goes. Like I said, it is a little bit aggressive. So, got the mask on. Let's go. As you can see, as I'm sanding it, the actual veneer is starting to disappear back up to the, the ridge line. And that's where we need it to be. It's going to sit nice and straight. And that's how it should turn out. Ready for your cross banding to just sit on there nicely. Okay, I'm Jed from GDK Veneering. Thank you very much for watching. Please kick like, and now I'm out of breath. Thank you very much.